And we're in for a fast-paced game today, it seems. These teams like to get out on the break and run as much as possible, Greg. Hey, B.A., get your popcorn. There'll be a lot of speed out there, almost a track meet. Believe that. Yeah, you see, each side has a great deal of speed. Both teams will be looking to play to their strength and get easy buckets in transition. And now the opening lineup for New York. Down low, it's Randall and Hartenstein. Jalen Brunson is out there with Emmanuel quickly. And it's Barrett the in the three with the small forward. And I don't think we've really seen many seven-footers who can pass like Jokic. So calm and easy with the ball and almost always makes the right decision. MP with it, and it's Brunson picking him up. Jokic passes to MP. And there's a three-second violation. Three-second violation. New York ball. Yeah, ever since the Nets relocated to Brooklyn in 2012, the rivalry between the Nets and Knicks has intensified. Now, both teams are trying to prove that New York belongs to them. Outstanding pass on time and on target. Now here's Jokic, guarded closely. From deep, MP. The shot is good, and the assist by Jokic. It'll be hard for the Nets to take New York City away from the Knicks. They've been there so long. That's so true, B.A. But the Nets have attracted more star players lately. Top free agents choosing to go to the Nets instead of the Knicks. We'll see if this trend continues moving on. And here are the Nuggets now. Following the bucket by the Knicks. From deep, MP. And that one makes him two for two. He's in his rhythm. That's a great beginning. Three for three from the floor. The Knicks have gone just two for four from the floor. Brunson finds Barrett. Here's Hartenstein, covered by Jokic. Outside Brunson. Clock at six. Pass to quickly. Three-pointer. Denver grabs the miss. Well, they put up a nice win against Chicago last time out. And it wasn't just their starters putting in work. Their backups were real spark plugs on offense. One thing we know the great teams in the NBA get production off the bench, and that was critical that night. Here's quickly following the score by Denver. A quick shot there. It's off target. Well, you simply have to shake that one off, right? You can't let that kind of missed opportunity bother you. Here's MP. And there are the Nuggets with another bucket. Their ball moving on this run has been tremendous. It's led to a lot of good, clean, open looks. Outside Barrett. Back to Brunson. Pass to Hartenstein. Shot to stop the run. Second chance effort. Nikola Jokic grabs the miss. Boy, this guy is a good finisher, so he misses a chippy. That's tough to take. Two minutes Murray passes minutes to MP. Two minutes. Oh, trying his luck from deep. And the Nuggets hit again from deep. And early on, they've been on a team. Just getting whatever they want offensively. Well, what I love is the game plan has been solid from the opening tip. And guys are making their shots. That's critical. Now a timeout called by New York. They defeated Utah in their last game. Oh, my. Talk about mental. Completely new group here for the Nuggets. A big group substitution here for New York. Hartenstein, he's checked in for Julius Randle. R.J. Barrett comes in for Hart. Quickly is checked in for Grimes. And it's Jalen Brunson in for Rose. So on the floor for New York, they've got Isaiah Hartenstein. Obi Toppin out there with R.J. Barrett. Then there's Emmanuel Quickly. And it's Brunson in at the one spot. Barrett can't hit. Denver has gone five of eight from outside the three-point line on this one. Pass to MP. And there are the Nuggets with another bucket. Making plays at both ends of the floor. And it shows up in the box score. Well, what I love is the energy they're bringing right now. They're ignoring the scoreboard and playing hard. Now here's Brunson. 
He had 16 in the win against the Jazz in Salt Lake City. And his passing was simply amazing. A lot of fun to watch. Defense dodged a bullet that time. Total breakdown. Murray finds MP. Top of the key. That's good. And the friendly bounce off the right side of the rim. The MP's got four points this quarter. The Knicks have got nothing to go in this quarter. 0 for 5. Offensively, it's been a struggle for them. Yeah, they need to stream together some shots to have any kind of chance. <laughs> I'll tell you what, they've rebounded the ball tremendously well. Now here's Murray. 18 points separating these teams. That's the biggest lead of the game. Phoenix from downtown. That's been typical of their performance today. They're sharing the ball and creating good shots. Here's Barrett. Turned in an outstanding game against Utah. Here's Hartenstein. Back to Brunson. Here's Quickly. Off the left rim and out. I know he's got to be frustrated right now, but the team is fighting from behind. He's got to stay with it. Yes, it's good. Murray's got his first two points. Their offense is looking like a well-oiled machine, getting any look they want. Well, what great game planning, what great execution. It doesn't get much better than this. And that streaking rack attack is the, the mobile first one down. drive. Two minutes. I love it, making their own luck. You don't want to let off the gas with the lead. Continue to make things happen. Jane and that Brunson. one's good for Brunson. R.J. Barrett with excellent vision. And it's not just the vision. It's the ability to put it on time and on target. Nicely done. Count that bucket. Give him eight. Well, oh, that's a nice you play. You've got to read the situation and go to your floater game when necessary. Time called here. The Knicks you decide to talk it over. Well, you know it takes courage to draw charges. Guys get trucked all the time, and they still call a blocking foul. You think more of those should be no calls, Grant? You know, being encouraged is the right word. If you're willing to step in there and sacrifice your body for the sake of the team, you know what? If you don't give them the charge, I prefer the no call. I like that idea. Green's checked in for Gordon. Julius Randle's checked in for New York. Hart comes in for Brunson. When they get their opportunity to punch it inside, they don't hesitate. MP outside. Randall pulls down the board. New York has gone 0 for 4 from beyond the arc here in the second quarter. Hey, great communication on the lob. Nice touch on both ends of that alley-oop. Hey, when he let go of the pass, I had no idea what he was going for. Murray passes to MP. Here's the three. It's good. And the assist goes to Murray. Murray's got his fourth assist with that last one. Outside Hart. For three, Barrett. Jokic grabs the board. And one of the reasons they're down right now is because they've fallen in love with the jump shot. Ooh, took him no time at all to get that one. This defense is getting spaced out. Three of the last five buckets have come from way beyond the arc. Nine seconds separating the shot clock and game clock. Barrett with it. Looking at his stats, he's getting just over 23 points a game. Pass to Hart. Let's the three fly. And it's Denver with a rebound. Jokic has got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. MP outside. He shoots. Oh, it would have counted had it fallen, but it is offline. And so it's Denver. Up 25 big ones as we head into the next 21. Excited first half. We'll see if things play out a little more evenly in the second. And for Denver, they're shooting very well, 62% and going right at the defense. Gordon is the four with the Joker in the middle. MP is out there with Jamal Murray. That's the five to begin the second half with Michael Malone. Man, they're having a hard time to finish the triple. That's three in a row. And the Knicks shooting 35% so far in this one. Brunson finds quickly. And here is Barrett. Back to quickly. 
Pass to Hardenstein. To the middle. Here's Barrett. Hits the jump hook. RJ Barrett's got his second basket. Good concentration from the man out of Toronto, Ontario. RJ Barrett, go ahead with the contact finish. That was another look at our Mobile One drive of the game just a moment ago. They're taking the onus on himself to make something happen. He okay, got it into down. the teeth of the defense and made them pay. And here's New York now. Brunson passes to Barrett. Back to Brunson. Pass to Randall. Quickly with the ball. Six to shoot. Sweet little floater. Emmanuel Quickly's got six points. Defensively, you can't afford to get stuck on the pick. You know exactly what that takes. It takes energy, it takes activity, it takes intensity. Now here's MP. 24 points for him. Here's Jokic. Banked it in off the glass. <laughs> Jokic just got his first basket. You have to credit their effort. I mean, they've done an amazing job on the glass. Now a timeout called by New York. That's a good timeout. They just can't get anything. Sometimes it just feels like misses become contagious. He wants to settle his guys down right now. Substitution on the court. Hardenstein, he's checked in for Toppin. R.J. Barrett comes in for Grimes. And Hart subbed in for Brunson. Randall outside. Pass to Hart. Book it. Josh and it's Randall with the assist. Assist from Hart's got his second Julius basket of the night. Uh, Julius Randall can do a little bit of everything. That's a great find to get his teammate open look. Your and nuggets. so it's the Denver Nuggets Seven, firmly in control Nuggets. with an impressive 48 point lead as the quarter ends. The hustle they've shown on defense has been tremendous. And more NBA action on 2K Sports coming your way right after this. And it's time to bring up the State Farm assist to the game. And the winner today coming from an unlikely position. It's the big fellow with the sweetest pass of the day. Well, we have some elite passing big men in the NBA, and you love that skill. Wow. And there have been two very different performances from these teams today as we get going in quarter number four. So on the floor for the Knicks. Josh Hart is out there with Isaiah Roby. Then there's Emmanuel Quickly, and it's Sims in at the center, locking down the middle. And it's Quickly with a miss. Denver is shooting 59% on this one, a good average. Murray passes to MP. Well, Grant, I know you collect art, so we've been hearing all about these NFTs that teams and players are creating. I gotta need a little instructional here. What's it all about? No. VA, first of all, memorabilia and collectibles have always been around. But yes, NFTs have taken it to a whole nother level. And yes, I do have an NFT. I don't fully understand it, so I can't explain it to you. But I know it's the next big thing, that's for sure. From deep, MP nails it from three. MP's got five points now in the quarter. Both teams are starting to find a rhythm here. And this is partly what the game has become, right? A matter of dueling three-point opportunities. Quickly from outside. The Knicks keep it alive. To the paint. Another shot. And it's Hart laying it in. And their offensive game plan is clear. Get it inside and go to work. And no lack of aggression on that move. Good for the 2K drive. Yeah, a double-digit deficit. They're going to have to play better. They need more of this kind of aggressive play. And here's MP from outside. 
Kept alive. And the shot counts. He's fouled. And it's a chance for a three. Tremendous team ever. Once they had that big lead, they were not going to let the visitors back into the game. And that'll wrap it up, folks. For Ali LaForce, Brad Hill, and Doris Burke, I'm Brian Anderson saying thanks for tuning in. We'll see you later.